No, of course I'm pleased for you. I'm doing cartwheels, listen. Happy now? No, don't answer that. <laughs> Look, I'll see you later, okay? Bye. Oh, I don't know. Half the time you can't get him to say a word. Now he won't shut up. You what? Sedan, banging on about him and Rana. What about him? Oh, they're getting married, officially, like. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, why? You just haven't seemed yourself lately. And then last night, that bow with Aiden. What about it? I don't know, but it seemed pretty full on. I just want to make sure you're okay. Yeah, I'm fine. I'll catch you later. So I'll be heading over to the nursing home this afternoon. On the van today. Well, the flaming thing won't start, so I'm running late. I've just come to pick up some food from the kitchen. Oi! See, didn't you hear me calling you outside just now? No, and I'm busy, so what do you want? Oh, what a charmer. I just wanted to ask you if Rana was okay. Why wouldn't she be? Well, I just bumped into Rosie and she told me she went AWOL when they were in town yesterday. Well, she seemed all right this morning talking about the wedding and all that, and she was fine in the pub last night. Well, even if she did get a bit leathered, maybe she just got bored of the company. I don't know. Does he get off okay? Eventually. He was running a bit late, though. Hence my being left with all of this. <sighs> Let me help. Um, so how was work? Oh, pretty quiet for a change. Did you get to speak to your family? Tell them the good news? <sighs> yeah, they were made up. Especially my brother. Are you okay, dear? You look a bit tired. I'm all right. I know you two have got a lot going on at the moment with the with the new business, the wedding, trying for a family, but even though things might seem overwhelming at the moment, it will all be worth it in the end. I know. It's just sometimes I feel a bit out of my depth. <laughs> have you got any advice? Of course I have. I'm a grandmother. All we do is give advice. Just talk to each other. Be honest with each other. That is the most important thing. Trust me. I know from experience. Oh, I'll get it. Hi. Good to see you. Come in. Hiya. Um, just wondering if I could have a quick word. Um, I will leave you to it. I said I'd pop into the community centre. See you later. Okay. Bye. So, what are you doing here? I need to know what's going on. And then I worked as a secretary. Well, mistreated and much worse. I didn't think you wanted to see me, especially after what you said. I might have been a bit harsh yesterday, but I was worried about you. So you do care, then? Of course I care about you, but I also care about Zidane. And right now, I can barely look him in the eye. But it's not easy for me, either. I love him. We're talking about starting a family together and getting married, but... But what? I can't stop thinking about you. How long have you felt like this? Since that night in the bistro, when I saw you kissing Imogen. I remember standing there, watching you both and hating it. Because you thought it was wrong? Well, maybe at first. But he wasn't that. It was because I was jealous. Of her. 